Several dozen producers gathered in Browning this afternoon to hear if they qualify for help after this past winter's snow. MTN's Kaylee Collins has more on the Livestock Indemnity Program and the Emergency Assistance for Livestock, Honeybees, and Farm-Raised Fish Program. District Mike Brown, Foster, the FSA Baltimore. State Executive Director, and led the discussion at the Blackfeet Tribal Chambers before handing the floor over to D. Anderson. Anderson explained how a producer can qualify for LIP or ELAP. Foster says the meeting was a success. It gave everyone a great opportunity to learn about the programs that Farm Service Agency has to offer to help people when there are weather disaster situations, as unfortunately was experienced here in the Browning area. Many expressed concern for the qualifications needed. For example, how to document a loss. Taking the photo, you know, of the, the livestock that's lost and it has to be date stamped. So I know how hard that could be for some of our producers and especially some of our older producers that don't, might not even have a camera. People from the FSA spent a majority of the meeting answering questions from producers. Dahl says it was eye-opening for a lot of people. I think we are more aware of where these regulations come from because of the questions that were asked. Foster believes the information people got from the meeting will be really helpful. Not only did they learn about how the programs work, but they were able to ask questions and get their uh, get answers for those questions that uh, are in such a way that they can now move forward in working with the local offices and try to get some relief that hopefully people will be eligible to receive. In Browning, Kaylee Collins, MTN News.